My lab is a drug delivery lab and we're interested in figuring out how to take medication and deliver it to exactly the right places inside the body to obtain a specific therapeutic effect without causing toxicity. One fact that is not commonly known about human breast milk is that it contains lots of human cells from the mother. And a typical four-month-old baby would consume on the order of 100 million of its mother's cells every day. That's a lot of cells. So the amazing thing to us about these breast milk cells is what they're able to do in the gastrointestinal tract. So normally it's very difficult to deliver molecules orally, particularly large molecules, because the intestine is simply not permeable to those molecules. And when we think about something like a cell, a cell is about a thousand times bigger than some of the large molecules that can't get out of the gastrointestinal tract. And yet we have these whole cells that are alive, they remain intact, and they're able to get out of the gastrointestinal tract, make it into the baby where they continue to live and proliferate. And so when we realized this fact, we thought, well, what a great opportunity we have then to use these cells as delivery vehicles to shuttle medicines into the infant's body that wouldn't otherwise be able to get to where it needs to go. Some of the cells in breast milk are stem cells. And these are some of the most powerful cells in our body because they can turn into any of the other cells in our body. And so one of our ideas is to engineer these stem cells such that they can enter the infant's body and to treat a variety of different diseases that are currently untreatable. So our hope is that this research will impact the world in a couple of different ways. One is that we're going to develop a much more robust understanding of the biology of human breast milk cells why they exist in the milk in the first place and what they do once they go inside the infant. And the other side of our impact is on the technology development side, which is to make these new therapeutics, which potentially have the ability to impact every baby that's born on the earth, depending on what their therapeutic needs are. We expect to have gained new fundamental understanding of the biology of breast milk cells and to have a sense of what they're doing inside of infants' bodies in the next several years. And so we hope to publish that work in the short term. And in the longer term, we are considering the development of a therapeutic. And uh, we would expect to see a therapeutic perhaps in the 10 to 15 year time period.